Hello, y'all. Crescent Moon here with Cinema, the baby. Um, recent events have made it so I really want to take time to say hi. Plus, I needed to do a vlog anyway because I haven't done one in forever. Um, you know, I just, I just, I've had so many people because, as you know, I play Second Life, okay? And there's a lot of turmoil going on right now, for lack of a better phrase. Um, families split up, they do whatever, friends go away. Um, I have one friend who gets really depressed, and he decides to be my friend one minute and then doesn't, which is irritating, but I'm still there for him when he decides to be there. But, you know, don't ever give up on people. That's kind of a main thing. I know all of a sudden I'm just like, hi, how you doing? Here's some depressing content. <laughs> or a depressing vlog, but, you know, it's, it's whatever. But, um, little butt here is very colicky, very cryy, very screamy baby. So, I haven't really been recording all that much. I'm going to be doing a mass upload here in a little while. If I haven't already. Depending on when I decide to upload this vlog. And if she starts being too fussy, I'm going to end up putting it on pause until she stops, but, um, I was watching this thing, one of the ads that come up about this guy, about how to have a successful channel. Well, I have over 40 of you that watch my content and like what I do, so I'm still pretty proud of the fact of our modest little family, because that's still 40 some odd of you that take time out of your day to watch what I do, <laughs> which is really cool. Um, so I wanted to update you guys. I am still doing Jack Hoff because, dang it, I made a promise, and you never promise something unless you, unless there is no other option as to why you can't. That's the only time that you break a promise, and there's no reason for me to break mine. So, I've got that going. Um, I am putting other little games and other things in there to kind of break it up a little bit. For my own, you know, I'm ADD, ADHD, so me. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the thing. Um, what? The other thing is, I know a lot of you are like, oh, God, another mom, baby, cutie thing. It is going to be a little bit of a mom channel, as I call it, because I know there's a lot of moms out there, and there's a lot of people... As you can hear and see, who have issues dealing with little ones and the fact that they cry. Okay? I'm also starting work, by the way, at the end of May. So, are you going to start being fussy? Do I need to put this on pause? Yes. Alright, I will be right back, guys. Okay. So, she stopped fussing and I was able to put her in her, in her little bed right here next to me. Um... There are going to be some bits and some vlogs and things where I'm going to do some advice with babies because there's a lot of people out there that are either first-time moms. Um, God, I'm constantly readjusting this thing because it's the computer thing. Um, I got little spots all over me. Um, and who aren't really just—it's not that they're not capable, okay, of taking care of babies, but it's very easy, especially within the first six months, to get frustrated and upset. So I want to be there for the first time moms, or even the moms who have had multiple babies, and it's not their first rodeo, to be like, you know what, this is my third, I've been there, it's okay. Be frustrated, be the mom that has to go, you know what, <laughs> and put them in their room for five minutes and let them cry their eyes out. Yeah, conflicting things say up to four months it's not a good idea to do that. But, like last night, she was upset because I wasn't holding her. Oh, well. I left her in her bassinet. I rocked her, I touched her, I talked to her. That still fulfilled an emotional need. So, that's where I'm at with, with the babies, is wanting to be there and do a kind of a thing with that. Um, I know I've, I've said I've had multiple projects going, 
Um, the bead loom is kind of put on hold because I can't really sit there and uh, weave right now. Not with her. <laughs> I thought I could, but I'm, I'm, I'm the perfect little engine who thought they could. So, yeah. Anyway. Uh, the gaming thing is still going to be a thing. I'm probably going to set up a Patreon. And when I do, I will uh, let y'all know. That's going to be where anything that you guys give me on that is not going to go toward anything here. It's going to go toward here. Okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that toward games that I'd like to play for you guys. But I can't afford to right now. Because again, you know, I'm just starting work in May. Alright, May 21st is when my job is supposed to start, so it's from like 7 to 3. So, mornings and afternoons I won't be home, and then evenings I've got things I have to do, and then so I'll be recording in the night, and then posting. So, I know I said I wanted to try to record at least once a week, or at least upload once a week. That gives me a chance to record throughout the week, and get into the swing of things. Because while I don't mind public speaking, and being here for, you know our little family, I have brain damage. <laughs> okay, and not just yeah, brain damage. Ugh. No, like I was in my early 20s, I had a fever of 105. So, I have literal brain damage due to baking my brain. And that, and I got stupid when I was 23. I drank and smoked pot all summer. For a summer, so. <laughs> I had my party summer. I'm 33 now, so. I, you know, it, it happens. People get stupid. So between 105 fever in my early, early 20s to baking and drinking my brain cells away, I have brain damage. So I, I forget things a lot. And that's the other reason why Draco Wolf is around with me. Not just because he's Cinema's daddy and my boyfriend and whatnot, but he helps me out a lot. And he helps me remember things. Um, and he'll remind me of things. You know, and then there's our, my roommate Alex. You know, he reminds me of stuff too, and Kay has stepped up and helped me with it as well. It's, it's almost kind of like a um, not a dementia because I don't forget who I am and stuff, but a minor Alzheimer issue, almost. I mean, if to kind of try to describe it, it's like walking into a room and going, "What the hell did I go in here for?" On a constant daily basis. And there's times when I'll do that. I'll be like, oh, I need to go do this. Oh, look shiny. Wait, what was I doing? I do that a lot. Just part of me. So. Anywho, that's going to be a thing. I might start doing a lot of um, beadery things as well. So those of you that are interested in beadwork, or perhaps you know someone interested in beadwork, have them keep an eye on the channel. Because as she gets older, and I have more time where I can just sit and work on things. These are things that I want to do. I've always been passionate about jewelry. I know I don't wear it as often as I used to, but I can't either. But I also haven't over the years because I just why? Yeah, I don't even wear makeup. If I tell you, yeah, all this right here is just me because I don't wear makeup. I don't do anti-aging project pro projects products. Eh. Um. I don't wear a lot of heavy foundation or powder, things that can cake my pores. So, and you would never guess I'm 33. I, well, okay, fine, maybe, but, <laughs> you know, gray and balding has a tendency to make you look older than what you are. But just wanted to update you guys on the fact that, you know, everything, I'm good, everything's cool, baby butts being a baby, that's you too. Um, a lot of plans for the channel is just getting to that point where I can do. <laughs> That's the biggest thing. So between then, between now and then, I'm trying to find content and things to kind of fill the space until I can get to where I want to be. You know, because babies will do that. You, you can have all the plans in the world, all the career and future and whatever the heck it is you want to do. The minute you get pregnant, that stops. Immediately. Like, no bottom line, no quarter. Done. Because that baby comes first. Or your children come first. So, I have to wait. 
Not that I mind. I <laughs> just all smiling over here at me because I'm being goofy. But I might start featuring a few more bits of her and how she's growing and laughing and having a good old time, huh? Yes. See, I don't know if I can get her to talk. You say hi? <coughs> really? <coughs> so is that what you do all day? Can you tell us more? No? You gonna be all quiet now? Huh? Oh, yeah. They can't see your face. You gotta talk. Yeah, she's not quite a big talker yet. Really? See, guys, that is what I live for. Okay? Those little noises and coos and all the smiles in the world is what I live for. And that's why, that, what you heard right there is why I don't really have a whole lot coming out right now. Because I'm not going to miss this for the world. So I love you guys, but immediate family, extended family, <laughs> I'll do what I can. So anyway, it's been almost 15 minutes, so that's that. We've got some games on hand. I'm still perusing Game Jolt. I'm still perusing Steam. If there's something you want me to play, then, you know, let me know. Uh, again, I will start up the Patreon. My biggest thing is, if anyone out there knows of a good program that can record full-screen games, that will open up so much in content for us, okay? <laughs> Because right now, my screencast, it refuses to do full screen. Like if it, like with, um, say the, the FNAF 3. I have it on the computer. It won't record it because every time the game comes up, there's nothing that will record it. Because it's not being seen on the actual computer itself. It's popping up as a new window. And I don't know how to make it play in windowed mode because I right click it and it doesn't do nothing. It just says run as administrator or run as this or run as that. And, uh, oh, God, excuse me. You know, I can open file location all I want. That doesn't do crap. Um, all that basically does is, uh, bring me to a folder. And if I can grab a hold of it. Move. Thank you. So I can at least see and talk to y'all at the same time. Um... Yeah, it doesn't do nothing other than the same thing as it did in the uh, on my desktop. So that's a thing. Oh, guys, excuse me. So if you guys know of a good program, let me know, okay? Because I seriously want to do this. I do have some more MMD coming out. That is not again. I know I've said this before, but that is not the main focus of my channel. And I've had a few people unsubscribe from me because I wasn't putting out content, I wasn't really doing, I apologize for that, but if you're here just for MMD, be patient with me. All of my effects, all of my models, everything, I had to wipe it because once I opened up that editor, it corrupted everything, even my own personal model. I will never have that model again. The little foxy in the blue dress. Not gonna happen. Um, a lot of the effects and stuff that I had before are gone. They've either been taken down, deleted, um, models have been closed, um, most of it, it took me, I, I would spend three to five hours a night just researching stuff, and a lot of that was trying to figure out the Japanese that it was in, and I had to translate that, so, it's a pain, but I do have a few that are going to be coming out, um, the comic's still a thing, hopefully, and, uh, we'll go from there. So, yeah, it's a day in the life of me. Teething, cranky, colic baby, and trying to do what I can for gaming and recording. So, what? Yeah, she's getting tired. So, I will see you all later. I'm signing off. And, <coughs> let's go from there. So, bye.